a husband's wife's vows is a special moment in marriage ceremony. An outward charge, a commitment from one to another. Tonight, you have decided to write your own vows. Let me encourage you in this. May these vows be more than words. May be more than a thought. May be real. I love you. As God has loved me, I'll forgive you. As Jesus has forgiven me, I promise to choose you every day and to put you before me in all that I do. To keep you, to hold you, to comfort you. I promise to make every day an adventure with you. I promise to embrace your awkward dances. <laughs> <laughs> to laugh at you and get time and travel to your bed. Be your best friend. I didn't throw her, I didn't throw her. AJ McGraw, you are without a doubt the one that I've waited for and prayed for. It took us a while to notice each other, but I love that when we did, God allowed it to just be fast and easy process. From this day forward, I will follow you as you follow Christ and promise to be your helpmate. I will walk alongside you in support of your God-given vision for our family. I will share in all your joys and sorrows. I will honor you, respect you, encourage you, and be faithful to you. I promise to be the one that keeps you the closest, kisses you on the daily, keeps that tummy full of some good food, <laughs> and we promise to always cover you and our marriage in prayer. BJ, I could not be more proud to take you as my husband. I'm doing this? We're doing it. Tomorrow. Tomorrow! 24 hours. Is it? Yeah, we'll be, we'll be hitched we'll be right, dancing now. right now. Oh my god.
congratulations. This is the day that you both waited for, prayed about for many years. Mallory and BJ, we see so many things in life that uh, they just go together, made for each other. My challenge to you today is this, that you would live together in faith and in courage. Always trust in the Lord with all of your heart. You accept this challenge today. Let's pray for this God. Heavenly Father, I thank you so much today that it was your will and purpose to bring this couple together. How are we doing? Okay. <laughs> uh, we chose the rings as a token of your marriage covenant. Every morning at work, during a rough season, may these rings be a reminder of your never-ending love. Repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I pledge my love and my faithfulness to you. Today and tomorrow and always. Today, tomorrow and always. Prior to this moment, you walk separate paths. Today, you become one. One light, one team. BJ Mallory, go light your flame. Eight months ago at this time, we were uh, celebrating uh, the marriage of, of my oldest daughter, and I had noticed the videographer that we had hired to be a part of that event was flirting with my, my second <laughs> child. And, uh, I somehow knew that it was history at that moment. And, uh, actually, several years ago, I, I just, just kept saying to my wife, "These two belong together. They're just so they're just they're just they belong together." But at the time, it seemed an impossibility. And yet, with God, we see how He clearly directs our steps and orders them. Your parents have prayed for many years that God would lead you to the spouse and complement your gifts and personalities. And tonight, you become one. We thank you for their lives. We thank you for bringing them to other and for a part of my family I am very proud I love them both they're in your care today may you bless them and keep them there in your care every day thank you Lord Jesus we pray in your precious holy name today Over the months, you've called each other many things, companion, friend, boyfriend, girlfriend, fiance, but today, for the first time, you will call each other husband and wife. <laughs> by the authority vested in me by the state of Florida, I now pronounce you husband and wife. BJ, you may kiss your beautiful bride. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Bernard John McGraw <laughs> the second.